Hey, so what's going on, my peoples? I'm back for another trailer reaction. Today, I'm super excited. Even though it's technically not a trailer reaction we're doing, it's more of a teaser reaction. Uh, the film in question is Chippendale Rescue Rangers. So here's the deal. It's a Disney project. And some people say I'm a shill for Disney. But you know what? If they make a product that's good, I'm going to watch it. I'm going to watch it day one. This one's a little different, though. This one, I'm not just riding for because it's Disney. I'm riding for it because it's Chippendale Rescue Rangers. I'm of a certain age where when I got home from school, Chippendale is what was going down. I was a huge fan. Started with DuckTales and Chippendale. Um, you know, everything that came in the afternoon block was, was really some of my favorites and an important part of my childhood. Um, so let's see, let's see what, what they got in store for us. Hollywood story. Chippendale Rescue Rangers, the show that defined a generation and turned two unknown chipmunks into international superstars. Sometimes but a success took Chippendale to new heights. To many more seasons of the Rescue Rangers. We were living the dream, dancing the Roger Rabbit with Roger Rabbit. <laughs> no one ever imagined. <laughs> it could all come crashing down. Torn by vanity. You look different. Hey, it's no secret I had the CGI surgery done. Consumed by temptation. My love of cheese got the best of me. I just love it so much. More, please. More, please. Is it possible that two living legends are destined to reunite? I'm thinking reboot. Nobody wants a reboot. <laughs> Ranger. You need a disguise or something. Grab the first thing you can. Uh, what? <laughs> Rescue Rangers 2.0. This looks weird. Remember that animation style where everything looked real, but nothing looked right? Who are you? Are you talking to us? Obviously. But it looks like you're talking That's to that window. Separate. It actually looks like I'm looking right at you. Okay. Look at my eyes, looking right at your eyes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I don't know. I don't know about that uh, movie suggestion there from YouTube, Marley and Me. Uh, I would admit I'm a grown man, but that that's one that will uh, catch me in the, in the feels. Uh, but no, let, let's talk about this trailer. That that was that was interesting. So they're going for the approach of uh, kind of a Who Framed Roger Rabbit, except taking it to another level. Uh, not just two D animation mixed with live action, but they have two D animation along with CG animation mixed with live action. And I don't know if you guys caught some of those, um, some of the different, different call outs throughout that, but there was, um, let's see, of course, the Indiana Jones, you know, because that's what their outfits were inspired by. But then, let's see, there was My Little Pony in there. Um, I saw Scrooge McDuck. Um, there's a couple of others. What were some of the other ones that were in there? Um, let me know which ones you guys caught there uh, when you were watching it, okay? Um, let's see. This this really to me opens up a ton of opportunities. Um, I think that Disney can on, can not only mine their existing properties for reboots and new shows, but in this situation, you know, this is just a standalone film. This uh, and it's thirty years later, so they're going for the nostalgia factor. They're they're talking to me, the, me as a parent of two little kids. Their goal is to get me to take my kids to the theater. Or actually, no, this is on Disney Plus, so they got me anyway. I would have went to the theater for this. But the catch is, this is going to be a family weekend. Me and the kids are going to sit down, bring the wife in, pop some popcorn, and watch one of my favorite cartoons, Chip and Dale. Um, but, but you know, I wonder, you guys tell me in the comments, what other Disney series do you think they could do this for? Um, of course, you know, I 
expect to see something come from Tailspin, you know, because after you went from from DuckTales with Scrooge and the boys, then it was Chip and Dale, uh, then it was uh, Tailspin. Uh, I feel like I'm missing one. Darkwing Duck. Uh, then they had Darkwing Duck. So, you know, they, they had all the spinoffs. It, it's kind of funny if you think about it. It's one of the original original shows that that really put a lot of spinoffs out from it, or this was technically one of those spinoffs. I'm super excited to see what this is going to do. I mean, it looks great. Lonely Island being behind it, that's a plus. Uh, you have, uh, who else was in there? Um, we saw a couple other guest spots. Uh, uh, who am I missing? Who am I missing? Oh, of course, Seth Rogen. Uh, having him in it is going to be huge. J.K. Simmons. He's a talent. Uh, shout, shout out to Kiki Lane that's in it as well. I mean, it's a really strong cast behind this. And the fact that they're going to be mixing the live action with the animated uh, is really promising. Um, so let me know in the comments. What do you guys think? Are you guys going to be checking this out uh, day one when it drops on Disney Plus? Uh, or is it uh, not really in your cup of tea? Uh, don't forget, comment, like, subscribe. We're going to be trying to do these trailer reactions kind of often here in the color commentary. And then pretty soon you'll see more and more articles and reviews pop up as well. But we can't do this without your help. So we want to hear from you guys. What do you want to hear from us? What do you want to hear about? You know, until next time. Peace.